Hey gang, this is Mike with my real estate dojo. And if you look at the stock market right now, just today, before I did this video podcast, it was down 442 points. Yesterday it was down 725 points. This whole month has been up and down. Um, and if you look at from the beginning of the year, it's been down significantly. So now is the time to be greedy. What do I mean by that? It's time to be greedy when it comes to real estate because very, very soon, the economy or the equity bubble bursting is gonna trickle down to the real estate market. And where you and I are able to buy real estate at, at a deep discount or get creative financing where the seller is willing to let us take over their house payment do some type of creative financing like a master lease without us going to the bank, okay? Um, now, most of you guys may not remember 2006 fourth quarter, almost the same thing happened. Real estate all over America, most major cities had a meltdown and you could buy properties at a deep discount using strategies like short sales all the way to just taking over people's payments to strategies like subject to and wraps. So for the, since 2016, I've been ringing the doorbell. I have personally been in, investing in gold. I've been personally taking my money out, out of the banking system because I know that the banking system is gonna crash very soon. Um, it has already crashed in other countries like Cyprus where they did a bell in and there was a freeze on people's accounts. Um, in 2006, 2007, I did a video where I went to my own bank and I tried to withdraw a large sum of money and, and they didn't have the money there. They told me I had to wait one or two weeks to get that money. Um, and very, very soon, I don't have a crystal ball, but if you just look around, you can see that the stocks are bubble, bond is a bubble, interest rate is all time low, um, consumer debt is all time high. Um, government debt is all time high worldwide. Um, so this next crash is gonna be a, you know, a bloodbath in the streets and it's not just gonna be US. Um, and since all these other countries are using what's called fractional reserve lending, which is basically the, the same magical thing that was created by the central bankers, okay? We're all pegged with the petrol dollar and if any other countries or any other banks in some other country, let's say Germany, like Deutsche Bank, goes under, then it could cause the whole domino effect. So it doesn't even have to be something that happens in America, like the stock market going down like it does. It could be anything, okay? Um, so, but this is not doom and gloom. There's great opportunities coming in, great opportunities. If you're an, an investor or if you have if you wanna be an investor and you haven't gotten into real estate, or if you're an existing investor and in a very upcoming months or weeks, or I don't know, I don't have a crystal ball, but in the upcoming future, there's gonna be a major real estate crash on top of the stocks. And people are gonna be hurting because they lost their savings on their 401. Um, they're gonna be scared and equities on their properties has came down and there's gonna be people that are gonna be defaulting their, their mortgages because the banks are defaulting on uh, themselves. We probably have to bail them out again uh, or they might do a bail in where they just take your savings in, in your bank. That's why I try to exit my money out of the bank system. Um, but, it, but it's gonna create a great opportunity for me. I'm gonna go around and help out all these home sellers that, you know, just bought their house, let's say three years ago. I know a lot of people that just bought three years ago, two years ago, four years ago, where, you know, real estate was prices were going up and up, up. Many realtors were, you know, that I know were suggesting to their clients that should bid over the asking price, about 10 grand, five grand, depending on the property, to, to get it because there was so much competition. So these home sellers now have now bought properties that are gonna be upside down, that are gonna be, have no equity, and it's gonna create a tremendous amount of um, wealth exchange from people like me that, or my students that have been watching me or have paid for our services. They know all these strategies that I teach in my mother course, uh, like subject to, wraps, lease, option, 
um, so on and so on. If if you are new to real estate, um, pl please note that the upcoming you know weeks or months or even a year are going to be a great opportunity for us or even newbies because you're gonna, you're not going to be able to buy properties below cost. Okay. For example, in 2006, 2007, 2008, I was able to buy houses in Dallas, Texas, below the cost of building the home. So if, if I had built another home just similar to that home, I would have to pay a lot of money for it. I would buy that similar home for 80 cents on a dollar, 70 cents on a dollar. Why? Because the market, the sellers were being motivated because everyone in their homes and their areas were losing their homes, going to foreclosure, doing a short sell, uh, downsizing, um, lost their jobs. Um, there was just fear, there was blood on the streets. So this next coming crash, which is happening, and I've been ringing the, the, the alarm since 2016, just a couple of, if you just go to my blog, you can see all the, the videos that I've done. If you're a homeowner, if you're an investor just bought a property in the past three or four years and you're trying to flip, flip it and you haven't, you better unload this property because there's a good likelihood that the, the meltdown's coming, guys. You know, uh, and if you're a new investor and you want to get into real estate, then just just you know learn a whole lot about it. You, you might want to just hold on for the crash to hit because you don't. I wouldn't want to buy a property right now at the top of the market. Okay, and if you're a home seller that you bought a property two or three years ago, and when the crash comes, you know your employer fires you because they go bankrupt or they have, or they have to downsize or you know you, you lose your money and your savings I'm, I'm really really sorry you know but if you need to sell your home please let me know with Mr. Investor I'd be happy to help you out uh, I'd be happy to pay for your move and get you the most amount of equity possible and if you're an investor that's professional um, and you want to step your game up definitely get into the Alchemy Stones class this new wave of foreclosures is going to be coming in Okay, it's gonna be a great opportunity for us to buy deep discounted properties or use some type of owner financing to buy properties, guys. I'm very excited. Uh, I know one, most of my students are gonna be very excited. Anyone that has um, the balls or willing to, is willing to run into the fire, the fire's coming, guys. And I'm gonna be one of those guys. I'm not giving you legal advice. I'm not giving you financial advice. I'm not a CPA, I'm just a refugee. But what I do know is when everyone's going right, when the herd is going right, I need to go left, okay? When everyone's buying you know, uh, homes, I'm not buying homes. When everyone's forced to sell or think in their mind that they have to sell because the news is saying it, the radio is saying it, the realtor is saying it, there's all these foreclosures around their neighborhood, then I'm gonna be buying when no one's gonna be buying. When the bank is not lending money, that's when I'm gonna be buying. Right now, um, anyone can borrow, get a house, Freddie Mac, Fannie Mae, they changed their you know lending requirements to allow more people to borrow money because so many people have debt, so many people have student debt. And so subprime is already here, but it's formatted. It's, it's just covered up in a different uh, wolf uh, with a sheep over it, okay? So it's already here. You can look around so many different companies saying, hey, do you need to borrow money for your business? I got gotcha. you. Do you need to borrow money for your house? I got gotcha. you. Do you want to put some stuff on your credit card? I got gotcha. you. Do you want to um, refinance your house? I got gotcha. you. You know, and everybody's offering that. And it almost looks and smells like 2006. Everywhere I go, they're building homes. They're building apartment complexes from Las Vegas to Denver to Boulder. Um, everywhere I've gone, they're just building and building. and what do you think is gonna to happen to these builders when the economy stops? All these builders are gonna go belly up, dude. All these nice apartment complexes um, that they're not finished, they're gonna have a hard time, guys, okay? Um, but, but it's great news for me and you. Um, if you wanna know how to get into the real estate business, definitely go to my website, My Real Estate Dojo, download the mother course. It's, it's uh, 171 chapters. It's everything you need to know about real estate from how to structure deals how to negotiate, how to generate leads, how to find funds, how to do this, some of this creative financing like owner financing, master leases, subject tos, how to structure all that. It teaches you everything you need to know. It's called the mother course. By the way, when you download this course, I also give you free coaching because my job is to help you get your first check or help you do a deal. 
that's why I do this. So when you download the mother course, you'll definitely get free coaching involved with it. All you gotta do to get the free coaching is, you know, download the mother course, study it, number two, three, take action, start advertising. When you find a motivated seller, fill out the seller phone script, the ninja phone script, and then send it to me, and me and my team will help you structure, you know, help you structure a deal or help you buy the deal for, for myself. Uh, whatever's required to help you get your first deal because that's why I do this for. And then this new crash coming up, it's gonna be a great opportunity uh, to get into real estate, guys. It's a great opportunity to buy re rental homes. It's a great opportunity to buy notes. It's a great opportunity to do master leases. It's a great opportunity to build capital gain, you know, where you buy a property today and five, six years down the line, it's going up in price, guys. Uh, if there's any questions, uh, let me know. Leave a comment below if you find this uh, video informative, click on the like, please share and leave a comment. See you later gang.